Okay, we're back for episode 13 of our full rebirth playthrough. My wife is playing uh, right now. Can mm -hmm. anyone explain to me why we're even taking this detour? Anyone? <laughs> some of us are on a mission to secure the material we need to, you know, save our homeland. How can you talk like that in a place like this? I'm scared and my wits here. Oh my know. gosh. This gee dude's too nice to freak me out. I love Kate Man, Sith. Nice, but who knows what he's planning? Stay alert. Yeah, we took two days off. We went to uh, Oklahoma City, and then I got sick with a stomach bug. That, that was fun. So <laughs> we're going to try our best. The home okay. of the Gi lies beyond. Now let us begin our journey. Not so fast. What's in it for us? Unless it's Materia, you can count me out. How strange you should mention Materia. My people are also in search of it. <laughs> okay, all aboard! <laughs> She'll trust anybody if they say Materia. I know. <sighs> Would have stayed longer if I could, but I'll be back soon. Promise. So this is all new to the original game, so there's no telling what's going to happen here. Right. <laughs> with the rocking of the boat? I want to move less, not more. <laughs> she doesn't like cars, boats. Aboard. Well, only because he mentioned materia. Be quiet. The planet is listening. And what's wrong with that? Anything that reaches the planet's ears in due time reaches those of the Cetra. Unfortunately, the Cetra are not a tolerant people. Excuse me, am I intolerant too? I'm Cetra. <laughs> <laughs> You're lactose intolerant. <laughs> you are indeed one of them, by lineage alone. You know not of their history. That has been lost to time. Their history? Consider your ignorance a blessing. The Cetra's past is fraught with That's horror pretty. and sorrow. I guess they wanted to flesh out the gi a little bit more. I guess so. So there I am, on the ground, bleeding out, watching everything go dark. Thinking, this is it. This is how it ends. Only, it isn't. Suddenly, the wind picks up out of nowhere. It tugs at me so hard, it feels like it's tearing my soul right out of my body. Next thing I know, I'm back in the orphanage. But nobody can tell me who found me or how I got there. It's a miracle. Looks Sounds like Charlie Sheen. Me. Yeah, he does. Whole freaking army unloading on my position. Whoa, he was drastically outnumbered. I'm feeling every single bullet. So the whispers are saving him. Them two are supposed to be dead, but the whispers saved them. Yeah. It's blowing. One minute, I'm outnumbered. 
And the next, I'm alone. None of it makes any sense. I somehow managed to beat the odds and wake up here, alone. Why in the hell did fate pick me? Can't think that way. <laughs> Can't not think that way. Their luck runs out, but mine doesn't. I'm the only one who gets a pass. <laughs> and now that it's just me, what am I supposed to do? You know? Yeah, I get it. Hey, come with me. Sure, but why? I'll explain on the way. Hmm. So, how's Cloud holding up? Mako Poisoning's done a real number on him. Doubt he's in for a speedy recovery either. But hey, hope springs eternal. Right. It's like they're in an alternate universe. Yeah. yeah. If he does recover, you can bet your ass he'll act like it was nothing. Shrug it off and say he's been through ten times no that shit. Are we talking about the same cloud? Come no on, the train guy's down, desperate to prove himself. Not like he needs us. to. Everyone knows he's a bona fide badass. Huh. Huh. Hey, it's like they know different clouds. <laughs> yeah. Because a merc. A sack of all trades. Why? Because one's not enough. I'll think about it. Guardians and reunions as this station takes. You here? Is this our punishment? Get a load of this. <laughs> okay, let's see. The destruction of Sector 7 was orchestrated by Shinra themselves. We can't let those murderers get away with it. People of Midgar fight back against our corporate oppressors by joining Avalanche. Seek us out at the lot off Petal Lane. Wow, that's bold. Yep. These guys are setting a trap for themselves. Shinra will just roll in and round them all up. Doubt public security will even bother going through the motions. Easier just to shoot and skip the paperwork. Then anyone who goes is... An idiot, I know. But idiots are what we need right now. Folks will risk it all. Wait! Don't tell me you're going! The things I do for friends. <laughs> Sounds like a trap to me. Yes, it does. The folks, topside. Hey. We'll just get all the rebels you in one place. About your purpose mm -hmm. in life? What you're doing here? Sure. From time to time. Or all the time. Would never have guessed. Didn't use it's to, but things changed. Went planet, through a lot after I joined Shinra, like, a lot. I bet. I ask, because ever since I woke up, I've been wondering about what to do with all this time I've been given. Hey, Biggs. You said before I ought to try picking up some work as a merc. Yeah. Because one's not enough. So who's the one? <laughs> Cloud. He didn't tell you? Must not have wanted the competition. When exactly did you meet Cloud? The day before we hit Reactor 1. So... Uh, how long ago was that again? <laughs> Weird. That's what I'm wondering. Right? The internal clock's busted. Yeah, mine too. What's that about anyway? <laughs> Good question. So... What do you think's gonna happen to our baby? I don't know. It would be great just to watch. A loving could have seen her. Wonderful children. Let's give it a break. Let's make it a break. Treat you and yours to something you know, special. But remember, mm -hmm. only one per person. I think I prefer being number two or three. Suits me much better. Yeah. Why don't we all go camping? Like, the guy the who only has to, to, worry to, 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 to worry about the how. And doesn't have to decide on the what. A minor role? 
<laughs> exactly. I'm no hero. So how come I was the one who got saved? Because someone needs you. You and your can-do attitude. Then who might that be? You were the guy uh, with Aerith. Uh, the honeybee girl. Who brought you back? Well, yes. And assuming there was someone, who could it have been? <laughs> That's a good question. Hell with it! Let's just do what we want! Ooh. It's just up ahead. Keep your eyes peeled. Copy. Nobody, huh? Yeah, total trap. Not a soul. Well, at least Shinra was a no-show too, right? Who's there? <laughs> hmm? Huh. New recruit? Uh, as if I'd ever join Avalanche. I just came to see what kind of morons would fall for your dumbass propaganda. <laughs> But I should have known. Nobody could be that stupid. <laughs> anyway, I'm out, losers. <laughs> I told you I wasn't cut out for a leading role. And here I thought I might have been saved for a reason. Some higher purpose. <sighs> Sorry for wasting your time. It's up to us to find our own purpose. I mean, who says it's got to be one way? Everyone's sitting back, acting like the world's doomed, but the future's not set in stone. We're not <laughs> apparently in this game. I know. <laughs> so long as we don't lose sight of what's important. <sighs> you know, what matters most of all when the going gets tough. I don't know, hopes, dreams, maybe? Something like that. So long as we've got those. And hold on tight and never let go. Like this? Like, like your life depends on it. <laughs> the world's lucky to have you. It's a start. <laughs> anyway, I gotta run. I'll be sure to pay a visit to Cloud when I get the chance. See ya. Think about what I said. Guess I should probably head home too. Hmm. Home, huh? I'm a little confused. Yeah, me too. I think you're supposed to go. I think we're supposed to be. Yeah, but Kyrie left this behind because remember it showed it in her cutscene. She forgot her backpack, which is filled with traveling supplies. Perhaps she hoped to join Avalanche after all. Hmm. Pretty environment. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's Aerith's health house. I'm back. Welcome home. Welcome home. Guess who I just saw? Biggs. Really? <laughs> She's so cute. Said he'd visit too. Oh yay! <laughs> Did he say anything about Daddy or Tifa? Oh, uh, sorry. Forgot to ask. Aww. <laughs> Zach, will you mind checking on Aerith for me? Sure. We're all headed for the same place. You'll see your daddy and Tifa again. Soon? Soon enough, Marlene. Soon enough.
Okay, that's what Cloud was like in the old game. Like when he was like in a wheelchair and kind of all messed up. <laughs> Hello in there. That's cool. It's like she felt something when he touched her hand in the other universe. Mm -hmm. normal <laughs> no way out ceremonial staff okay this one's 50 attack 54 oh 70 we do have one that's better just forgot to equip it. Yep. Instead of a vending machine, it's like a rock. Yeah. <laughs> a magical rock. That is cool. New synergy. Is that for Barrett? Yeah, for Tifa and Barrett. Ooh, three MP. Wow. They do not give you much MP in this game. No, they're stingy. He only has, she only has five. I thought you can afford anything. Well, I guess you can afford that. We're all rested up. Yep. It looks like a boss battle's coming up. Welcome to our domain, children of the planet. <laughs> Y'all hear that just now? Our flesh is gone. Yet our spirits are condemned to linger. Outsiders such as we are unwelcome, forever denied the planet's embrace. I feel for you. Can only imagine how tough that's been. My kin now dwell within these effigies. I beseech you, lend them your ears. Long has it been since they have had... Do you ever feel like you've been led into a trap? Yes. <laughs> like right now. Like right now. When he's like, 
it's safe. Follow me. Go to the boat. And we're like, sure. <laughs> and they're not bound to the planet, and so she rejects them. Because you have to come from the life stream to return to it. Which means these dudes can't die, right? <laughs> they're invincible! I'm not sure that's something to celebrate. Right? <laughs> I'm with Kate on this one. With no hope of release sounds like a fate worse than death. As if you know anything about dying. Uh, I mean, are you even really alive? <laughs> Another stuck spirit, perhaps? We shall <laughs> not rest till the materia is ours. You and me both. <laughs> Mom just texted me back saying she watched Office Space for the first time. Did she like it? So she, yeah, she liked it. Good. It's like it's one of my favorite movies of all time. Yes. I love at the beginning when he's like <laughs> listening to like gangster rap music and he like rolls the window up and <laughs> turns it down real quick. Oh, I know. <laughs> Yeah, you just said that. You know, if like using your abilities today. Well, I was fixing to, but like every time I went to do this, uh, it won't let me use fire for some reason, and that's my favorite. Use braver. Well, I'm gonna. <laughs> Maybe he put silence on me. Maybe that's that thing I got. Oh, I think so. Every time they hit you, they silence you. Not cool, man. Yeah, I kept trying to use fire and it was like, no. <laughs> it was our fate to be spurned by the planet forevermore. Thus did we resolve to forge our own path to salvation. With materia, you mean? We long to lay hands on the materia of peace. The music's very, like, tribal. Yeah. Yes, you're poison. I mean, you're silenced. But I wasn't a second ago. Or I didn't have the symbol. Brace yourself. It's over. I just don't understand the point of using fire if braver hits just as hard. Because it's cool. There is but one thing. And sometimes, if fire is their weakness, it hits a lot harder than braver. It just depends. Yeah. And that is materia. So an ultimate materia? Where is it? You gotta tell me! <laughs> the materia of peace. We shall find the end for which we have long yearned. Let me use it so maybe it wore off. Our ultimate salvation is cessation, it is nothingness. Our wish is not to exist, but rather to no longer exist. That's sad. Ultimate salvation is nothingness? Okay. In the purest of materia, we place our hope 
y'all, but I got a sinking feeling. <laughs> Think we probably don't want to overstay our welcome here. Yeah, I get it's that feeling feel too. <laughs> His only desire is death. And if the planet won't let them have it, well, who's to say they won't let the planet have it? Save uh, me! <laughs> sure. Don't you think someone responsible like me ought to hang on to that materia? So it doesn't fall into the wrong hands. I think we shouldn't get involved at all, Lassie. Little late for that. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think he wants us to do for him? I like how they both hugged onto Red. Oh no. Purest of materia no more, with pain and spite made black. Steeped in our one desire, purest of materia no more, with pain and spite made black. Steeped in our one desire, purest of materia no more, with pain and spite made black. <laughs> Oh, cool. Steeped in our one desire, purest of materia no more, with pain and spite made black. Whatever that materia is, we can't let them have it. No matter how much they want it. I don't know how far we can let this go, but for now we play along. The passing of the eons of the star we called home began to wane. Until at last it was subsumed by your own. The earth shook, seas boiled, skies shattered, and time stopped. Few of my people survived be careful. the chaos. Enough. Calamity. Those who did began a new life. Barrett and Cloud are both really hurt. To the planet, we were not welcome. You're right. I'll cure no. as soon as I get an FTP. If you're not silenced. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, cure it's let me do. Oh, I didn't do Barret. I was hoping the Kyurga would hit him. I don't think you have AoE spells in this game. So the Kyurga is probably just a stronger cure? Yeah. There used to be materia that they were all materia to make the magic AoE. Mm-hmm. I haven't seen that in this game yet. It might not be in the game. Oh, it's because I don't have fire. We switched it with somebody. Probably red. That was right. That makes sense. There we go. There goes your MP. I'd save it for curing. They don't give you enough MP to go all cast some fire and shit. <laughs> Those not born of the life stream can never join its flow. One cannot return to that from which one did not arise. And so our souls sought refuge here. Yet idleness brought no solace. 
Our days, a penance imposed by the planet for the sin of our existence. And now, our only wish is to be freed from this prison, to be granted true release. From the planet, we claim the greatest of materia, a most sacred treasure, and imbued it with our desire for freedom. After an eternity, the materia began to stir. And thus did we rejoice, <laughs> so excited. knowing that salvation was within our grasp. We rejoiced, so convinced were we that our prayers for release had not been in vain. Yet the loathsome Cetra trespassed upon our lands and stole the treasure that would grant us deliverance. Therefore, we ask that you retrieve it, the Black Materia, key to our oblivion. Please. Wasn't it in the pyramid? It alone can in the old game? Us from Was that the black one or the white one? The black one, I think. Oh, okay. The Gi cannot rest until our sacred treasure has been restored to us. Moreover, in redressing the crime of her ancestors, the Cetra may help us to let go our ancient grudge. Where is it? It is said the orb lies within a place of Cetra worship. Oh yeah, the ancient a temple. Place of mm -hmm. Cetra worship. Or temple. You know what? I have an idea. <laughs> At least, I think I do. Forgive me, Hollow One. If Hollow I One. <laughs> now hold on there. I'm friend to one and all, thanks to my crystal ball. No matter your need, I have the right read. <laughs> He's strange, but you trust him. Really? Huh? Mm. Alas, it appears we have been discovered. I trust you will return our materia to its rightful home. Only you can end our torment. Uh, I guess we're back. I guess so. <laughs> yeah. He detoured us before he left. Yeah. <laughs> this game's all over the place, man. I know. We need to get moving. Right. I'll make you proud, Dad. Just wait. It's good to see you again. Allow me to escort you to fellow Bugenhagen. Please, this way. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Hook, line, and sinker. Those undead suckers actually think we're gonna give them back their materia. They called it their salvation <laughs> or whatever. But to me, it sounded more like something with the potential to wreak some serious havoc. Nope. No way in hell are we letting them have it. Can't let him have it either. 
Him? Sephiroth. Did no one else sense him? Uh, no. You're the resident expert. If you say Sephiroth was there, I'll believe you. Wait, wait, wait. So, are you saying Sephiroth's after the Black Materia too? Probably. Better to assume he is. Well, come on! Let's go, let's go! Can't let anyone get between me and my Materia! So, Kate Sith, I gotta ask, how do you know about the Setra Temple anyway? Uh, well, like, uh... I wouldn't say I know about it, exactly. Not directly, anyway. What's that supposed to mean? I just recall some document or other discussing its existence. If we can get to a Shinra terminal, I should be able to find it again. Terminal, huh? They said any up here? I think so. But I bet old Boogie will know for sure. Boogie? <laughs> Could have just gone this way to begin with. <laughs> Thank heavens you're alive. I feared you might have returned to the planet. Oh, come on. We both know you didn't need to worry about me. After all, I am the son of Seto the Watcher. Forgive me. But if I recall correctly, Shinra should have set up a transmission terminal here in Cosmo Canyon. So, where is it? Oh. What did become of that thing? Ah, yes. Now I remember. I was so fascinated by the technology it employed, I did some tinkering. Some tinkering, I say, though it was quite a lot. But now it serves a decidedly more practical purpose. You've got to be kidding me! <laughs> they turned it into a well, windmill. <laughs> do you know about a Setra temple? A temple, you say? If you mean a place where they worshipped gods, none exist. The Setra never engaged in such practices. I didn't know that. Maybe it was referred to as such by someone ignorant of their culture. If instead it is a site of importance to the Setra that you seek, texts do speak of one, and of the pains taken to conceal it. So, it does exist? <laughs> I don't think the Setra are very nice. Oh, I know not where mm -hmm. it is. Huh? And even should you find it, I would urge caution. They were a star-crossed people. To follow in their footsteps is to court tragedy. <sighs> However, the rewards may yet outweigh the risks. You must bring every one of your senses to bear. For then no secret will elude you. However well hidden. And when you return home, I hope you'll share your discoveries with me. Fellow Bugenhagen! What is it? I'm a little busy here. Another man in a black robe has come. What should we do? Well now, a friend of yours? Where'd you see him? Oh, uh, the village gate. We should check it out. Yeah. Oh, oh, nice. That's nice. Teleports. That robed man is at the village gate. One of my colleagues is tending to him for now. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Yeah, teleport me. Yes. Nanaki! Is this man okay? He is, albeit rather weak. Not sure why, though. I know Mako poisoning when I see it, and this isn't it. Nibu... I'm... Nibu... I'm... Nibu... Last part of the game. Artifa and I grew up. Of course! Nibelheim has a terminal. I'd bet my whiskers on it. <laughs> it, uh, had a terminal. 
Cloud. Remember what you told Gein attack back there? That I might be weird, but you can trust me. Hey, well, even if you were lying, I'm going to prove to you that you can trust me. That I'm on your side. It's not that. <laughs> we should go. Hey! <laughs> Wait, you're talking about heading to Nibelheim from here? There's no roads you can take far as I know. Maybe we can't go by land. But by air. Meaning we'll need smoke. Right then, back to the airstrip we go. Side, it may serve as a good place to start. I'll send you the coordinates right away. Coordinates. It's about time that the game opened up again. We've been stuck in Cosmo Canyon for a couple hours. Yeah. I'm just kind of ready to beat the game. This game is freaking long. I'm ready to move off my life. That one's called Sildred. We've been playing for two weeks now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did you see that bro? Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Have you heard about Avalanche's crimes? There are wanted posters for them. Did you want to go to Nibelheim and then come back here later? Oh. I mean, I guess we can. Did you ever find out if you can go back to do stuff after you've beaten the game? Oh, I'll uh, research that in just a second. So we need to head to here. Because I'd prefer to do that, honestly, at this point. We've been playing for way too long. I didn't realize it was going to be like a 60 hour game. That's insane. You can beat the original in 30 hours. Um, before we do that, I mean, can we at least like go back and do the card thing that, that opened up for us? If you want to. Wise, yes. Was he in Dust Bowl? Yeah. Okay. I couldn't remember. Not letting us fast travel to there. You can go Dust Bowl. Oh, fast travel to other regions currently unavailable. Oh, we'll just, I will just do it at the end of the game. I'll let you play on your own and do whatever you want. that you've got a choice, but thank you for choosing Bronco Airlines. Sit, my friend. You couldn't give us a lift in Nibelheim, could you? A little far. But not too far, I reckon. The old girl should be more than up to the challenge. So you can? Yes. Okay. We'll just do that then. Let's speed the main story and then we can go back and get the collectibles later. Yeah, yeah, you can. That's and cool. um, all the mini games have like hard modes that unlocked. That's Not cool. all of them, but some of them, like yeah. Fort Condor and stuff. That's cool. Yeah. I think you're flying right now. Oh. Uh, kind of. Just the camera. 
that rocket town over there? Look to your left. No. It's an old reactor. Yeah. Beat chapter 10. Nice. Sephiroth, wait up! Bring me the black materia. I get a ride with him? Yeah. <laughs> I guess so. Looks like we're not the only ones headed for Nibelheim. Huh. Almost like they swung by Cosmo Canyon just so they could lead us here. Sorry, just thinking out loud. Forget about it. Should be the last area, right? Yeah. Uh. Oh. Bless you. <laughs> uh, Kate, meant to tell you before, but the terminal's probably gone. Nibelheim burned down five years ago. It did. I. Not to worry, though. The terminal is as snug as a bug in a rug. <laughs> Shinra wasn't about to let that facility... In the original game, it actually never burned down. They rebuilt it. And Shinra was trying to hide it. But no. Remember? Mm-hmm. But I do know is that it's the only lead we have on that materia. So... This nothing. We should be Come Oh, he's eating your face. It happens. Come on, let me out. Time to burn it on now. They're your favorite. They're weak to fire. That's right. And he keeps eating my face. What happens when you never dodge or block? We'll eat you. Feels like Aerith and Tifa are tied. You're gonna have to make Tifa really happy. <laughs> it's hard to do if you won't let me do quests. Yeah, but the game Chocobo. is the game is like stupid long. It is. But there's no like we don't have to beat it at a certain time. I do. I wanna move on. We could take a break and do other things and then come back. Good. But I kinda wanna just get it over with. Yeah, but that's not a good way like a good outlook on a game. Let's get it over with. No. I'm just afraid oh, if I take a break from I, wanna... I might never come back. You might need the chocobo, though. Ooh, ooh, ooh. True. Because some areas might require the chocobo to get to uh, to get there. But those chocobo missions are really hard. You usually do those. 
Oh, I can do it for you. Okay. Let me follow this owl first. Get to it! No surprise. Suck it. Like they're supposed to climb the wall or something. That's what I thought. <laughs> Guess not. Hmm. me to go that way, but I didn't see a way to go that way. Did you? Not really. There was something kind of on the side of the mountain. What the heck, man? <laughs> we can't climb the wall. There's that stupid owl again. There's another one right there. But how are you supposed Back to, into that cave. How are you supposed to go up there? There's nowhere to go. Maybe you're right. Maybe we do need the chocobo. Somehow. <sighs> this game really frustrates me. Yeah. The areas are too, like... I don't know. I prefer the original game, like, ten times more. I like the graphics, but the original is way more fun. wants you to go that way but it's like dude we can't we can't climb a freaking wall right. what do you expect me to do <laughs> how 
how did the ropes get all get over here when they said there was no road? Well, that's you, a you good can only question. Fly in. How the heck am I supposed to get down to that? That's why I'm just telling you to freaking skip this stuff. Let's just do the story because it's. You said I would have to have a chocobo. Well, maybe I don't know. But you're just you went back to the where you came from. This is the airstrip. You see what I mean though? Like the world map is too confusing. Well, it is confusing, but I mean, we're oh, smart wow. enough to figure it out. We just, you know, you gotta be in a good mood first. No, I'm in a good mood. I'm just being honest. I think the game has a lot of flaws. This is one of them. There we go. Well, sound just like him, don't I? Your turn. You have to stay in the grass, I guess, and they can't see you. <laughs> How do you get around? They're deflating. <laughs> That's cute. Maybe you're supposed to go up and around. Bait. Chocobo bait. Okay, so this was just to get bait, not to go around. Yep. Because Cloud can't, you know, jump down. That'd be too easy. Can't do that. Does it grow back? Uh, I think so. Maybe. It's hard to see because of the camera. Yeah. Oh, dude. Don't shoot so far. Why is he aiming so far over there? How, why is he aiming so high? I don't think you're supposed to get those chocobos to go. I think you're, yeah. Huh? I don't think you're supposed to get those chocobos to turn around. I think you're supposed to get Selena to come to you. Like throw over near her and get her to come through the maze of cactuses. Does that make sense? Yeah, cause like the throwing is way too far. Like yeah, it, I think you're wants... trying to bait her through the maze, not you. That makes sense.
Oh, awesome. You did it. Okay, it said to go approach her. Yeah, but I want her to turn away from us. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah. You did it. That was awful. <laughs> Good bird. Pretty too. Awesome. So can this for um, bird fly or something? Cause that one area looks like there's a wall. Well, it said wave runners. Yeah. I bet that's what we're gonna. Mm -hmm. Yep. Let's get some lunch. Yeah, I'm a little cranky. Yes. <laughs> All right, we're back after a really, really, really long break. About six hours. <laughs> uh, I just wanted to say I'm sorry if I seemed a little cranky earlier. I was really sick and not thinking straight. Really cranky, but I feel better now. So thank goodness. We're going to keep on trying <laughs> and I'll keep my crankiness level to a minimum. That's right. To be honest with you, I'm not used to playing 50 hour games, 50 plus hour games anymore. Feels like an endurance sometimes. Mm hmm. But now that we have the chocobos, we should be able to get that one secret now in the water. Apparently these dudes will go flying in the air when you're in the water. So if you follow that owl, maybe now we can do it. I hope so. Yeah, it's in that cave you're left up there. Yeah, keep going in there. If you're right, there you go. Are you supposed to hit those yellow things? I don't or is that, know. Or is that, no, it's a fan. It's a fan. I guess it shoots you up uh, more in the air. Cool. I saw those earlier. Remember seeing those around there? Around the, the water? The yellow bubble, uh, balloons? Uh-huh. I remember seeing them. This may be the final summon in the game. I bet it is. That I know of. Yeah. There might be some secret ones. I always thought Bahamut would go after Odin. X, circle, square, triangle. X, circle, square, triangle. Okay. He looks cool. X, circle, square, triangle. X, circle, square, triangle. Dang oh, it. Oh, he missed triangle barely. <laughs> you hit it too soon. Oh. You need a metronome? <laughs> I'm doing, I, can be, I can be your metronome. <laughs> okay. There you go. Yay! <laughs> Thought I helped it, but whatever. Yeah, he does look cool. You look like an anime character. Mm-hmm. Analysis complete. I managed to extract the necessary data from the crystal. This should allow me to strengthen your materia. Usually when I get mad in this game, it's usually mostly it's at Chadley. Most but, of but the earlier time, I was yes. getting mad at everything. I was mad at the Chocobo quest. In fact, I cussed so much I actually had to go there and edit myself. <laughs> I, was uh, like, yeah. I was like, wow, I lost it. <laughs> you did. I'm gonna I'm gonna I thought it'd be kinda fun to just bleep myself, but like nah. No. People don't need to see my mental breakdowns. No. That's why recording's that a lot better yourself. than streaming. Because streaming, <laughs> it's like you can't take that back. And the monkey, the monkey's out of the bottle. You can't put the monkey back in the bottle. That's right. <laughs> but yeah, we'll try to play at least another hour. Then we'll call it a day. Hopefully tomorrow I'll feel better. I think it's been... Has it been three weeks now? We started playing March 1st. It's March 15 now. Piece of cake. Um, so two weeks. Feels Today like is Friday. It came out two weeks ago today. Feels like three weeks. 
Not bad. You know, a lot of people probably haven't beaten it, just like we haven't. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. Hmm. People who have jobs, you know, only yeah. play a couple hours a night. Accents. Yep. First time. Same here. Usually I'm not one to rush, but... Back till now. Didn't think there was anything to come back to. Sorry. <laughs> it's all right. Lots happened since... Aw, do you need your bench, bench. bench fixed? <laughs> One thing I noticed in that last playthrough was uh, we really suck at the piano. It's really hard. <laughs> I, I'm having trouble with that. Uh, I, uh, yeah, me too. I wish it was a button press, not a joystick. It me feels too. like it's really hard to, to get it perfect. Yes. I think that's kind of my only complaint right now. As mini games go, the rest of the mini games have been really fun. Mm -hmm. Chocobo, the racing's been my favorite. So oh, far. me too. Yeah, we did all definitely. the we did all the circuits. I wouldn't mind going back to playing hard mode on that one. Well, I think I think Queen's Blood might be my favorite, and then Chocobo Racing. Yeah, I really really love the card game. I think uh, uh, it's nice. I like I like Triple Triad better, unless you have the all rule or random rule. But I have a, a memory card save editor. Where I can go in there when I start the game and just wipe it out from existence. No random. No random. That's all I'll do in, the, in eight to when it comes to cheating. <laughs> His lucky a shot. Because if you follow like guides online to get rid of random yourself, it's really random. It could work. Most of the time it doesn't. It's a lot of resaving the, and reloading the game. Really annoying. Yeah. So I, I decided years ago I'll just use a memory card save editor. <laughs> Man, these guys are hard to kill. Yeah, shut up, me. I know, dude. <laughs> she has a shut up button in the options, but it's only if you've already done it before. Yeah. Already tried all those. I'm surprised it wasn't fire. I know. Bird, it's on now. Yeah. What was that, thunder? Uh, fire. So maybe it was, because that pressured him. Oh, you almost staggered it. Almost. The question there is, can you beat go. them all now, though? Okay, you randomly singing is not going to make me... Not helpful. Not hit you And less. it will not make us like you more. <laughs> It's like they try to make her as annoying as possible. Yes. I did it. It wasn't much of a challenge. <laughs> people on 4chan were saying, uh, I guess a lot of people, I don't know about 4chan people, but a lot of streamers supposedly don't like Yuffie, Yuffie. Really? But I don't like May. I'm like, where's all the Chadley and May hate? Because they're the ones I hate the most. Yeah. Not because yeah. it's, it's just they, don't, they don't shut up. Exactly. They have this anime monotone voice. They talk like this the whole fucking time we were trying to battle, and it's really annoying. It's just like, shut the hell up. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm cussing again. My bad. Calm down, Clay. Yes. Calm down. I notice when I'm sick, I, like, I'm going to open mic. And you have less patience. <laughs> you need to put some armor on this Chocobo. Oh, yeah. Does it glide, too? Uh-huh. That's cool. <laughs> Ashwood. Oh. There you go. Oh, oh it's an item being clicked. It's not a fan. It's an item. Okay. That's the owl's still here. Oh, there's another one right there. Uh -huh. So the other a cave was something different. Yes. That one was for Odin. This one's a live stream one. Oh, okay. No, get off the chocobo. No, get off the chocobo. That's another thing I hate. <laughs> I wish you had to press a button to mount so that you wouldn't mount if you didn't want to. After you play a game for 50 hours, you start to focus on the negatives and I'm sure I'm not the only person that does that 
I'm sure we'll offend some fanboys out there. I... This game's perfect. There's nothing wrong. It's a masterpiece. <laughs> the things that I would change, I would have a button to get on your chocobo so you don't just mount automatically. And I would have waypoints on the ground when you set them on the map. And that's about it. I give Tifa the ability to always wear the bikini. Well, obviously. <laughs> It's a pretty area. Mm -hmm. I didn't read any spoilers, but people keep saying that the ending sucks and the Nibelheim ma mansion sucks. So we have a lot to look forward to. Well, maybe by the time they got to that point, they're just haters. Close, would you? <laughs> you need to jump up there from the water. I honestly oh, from I the water. For okay. this, but... It's just too weird. Tifa needs a hug. There. Oh, 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 you almost had it. <laughs> okay, one more time. We can do this. Do you have to land on the landing pad? Hmm. Jump on the bridge when you're about to cross the bridge. I think you can jump all while on the bridge in the middle. Right here? Yeah. Like walk over the water. See what I mean? You might be able to lift that way. Oh, oh my god! Me up. Jeez. <laughs> that's that's the right way to do it, right? I f I'm f yeah. Like, like point towards the bridge. Sure. Point at the bridge before you go up. You, you're looking away sometimes. There you go. Yeah, it's kind of hard to turn him the way you want him. What she said. <laughs> Maybe after people play a hundred hours, they have a certain expectation for the ending and it's not what they were wanting. Yeah. So I'm pretty sure what I have is either the, the rotovirus or something along those lines. Because or the norovirus. Norovirus because I cannot keep food down or I'll, I'll save you the details, but... Um, I drove home from Oklahoma City yesterday, three hour drive, and somehow I held it all in. At the gas station, I walked around, <laughs> think I'm gonna hurl any given moment, and there's people all around me, including workers. I thought about going to the restroom, but it's probably gonna be a line, and I didn't wanna hurl right there in the side of the building. So I was like, well, maybe I should go behind the dumpster. Oh my god. But gosh. no, a guy was walking his dog. <laughs> and I held it in, I don't know how. Somehow. Somehow. I, you shouldn't do this, but I didn't drink any water for those three hours. But when I got home, I started drinking like, and then that's when the accident started happening again. So it's probably <laughs> a good thing I didn't drink when I was in the car. But it's dangerous because you can get dehydrated. Yes. But it's pretty scary though when you're in a car and you have diarrhea and nausea. Mm -hmm. And all I had was a little sack. I mean, what am I supposed to do with a sack if I have diarrhea? Right. Yeah. It's terrible. It was a, one of the longest three hours of my life. I was counting down the, by the minute. And I was thinking the whole time. And you were kept looking at the GPS. Okay. Oh, yeah. I, that's what I was doing. I was just staring at it. 200 miles left. 199 miles left. I kept thinking, <laughs> this is going to be it. I'm going to sit here and I'm going to puke and crap myself at the same time. <laughs> in front of With my kids. With your whole family in, in the wife. car. <laughs> but you didn't. It was a miracle. I could have told you to pull over, but I don't know if you get arrested for those type of things. I don't think so. It's not like, I mean, you can't help it. Get arrested for public defecation? I don't think so. In India, they're like, what's that mean? <laughs> Cloud, by analyzing the life spring data, I was able to look. It should yep, be yep. near. We know. Oh. You did the thing and you found some stuff and too, we're going to go get too it. Too long didn't read, bro. Yep. I mean, change it up a bit every now and then. Don't just say the same thing. I don't know who's more annoying, though. Die Hard Man? Oh, I like Die Chadley. Hard Man. Yeah, but every five seconds. Sam. Sam. Oh, Sam. That like is you hear true. that all yeah. <laughs> 30 hours or however long that game is. Sam, 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 Sam. <laughs> I wanted to shut him. I wanted to permanently mute him. 
permanently Add him to my him. block list. <laughs> no more talking to me. Shima's always really bad about shoving Exposition. tutorials down your throat. <laughs> Final Fantasy is the same. Remember when Quistus gave you this like hour long tutorial? Yes. And you're just like, dude, let me go find out on my own. But then her instruction was so complicated when I was a kid. I still, I, I followed it to a T. I still didn't understand it. It's a weird system. But you can easily abu uh, abuse it though. You play cards and Squall hits like a truck. Oh yeah. I hope they remake that one next because I loved eight. Uh. I don't know. Because, see, I really love this remake. I know that there's a lot of things that annoy you, but I love it. Like, I've been missing it for three days. Just remake 8 with the same graphics. Just remove how leveling works. By same graphics, you mean, like, this graphic, right? No, like the original graphics. Uh, just just no. fix the freaking levels, monster levels from leveling with you, and I'm good. No, make it, make it look this cool. That's the one thing about 8 that really hurts it. The item draw system didn't work really well, and le monsters level with you, so it punishes you for leveling up. It makes the last boss like almost impossible. You're supposed to use like Odin or whatever to, or Diablos, I mean, to do encounter none. Yeah. And you level off the cactus bars. Okay, like this floating chocobo thing is so cool. That is cool. I wish we could have done that in the original so cool. forest area. Yeah. We could have gone around the jungle a lot easier. We could have kicked it. Choco chick. Kick. Oh, I guess so. Is that all it was? Um. Our party's so big. I know. You're all huddled together. I don't think there's anything else up here. It's not. There's just barrels, crates. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, okay. Here we go. You found something. Here's the thing I need. So there was something up here. Well, I knew there was because there was that thing on the not map. On the map, yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. As much as I enjoy the graphics, and I enjoy the funny story. <laughs> I'm gonna take you all out. <laughs> <laughs> I still prefer the original. <laughs> That'll do. <laughs> but it's still probably the one of the best Final Fantasy games they've released. Uh, yes. Single player wise, since 12. Yes. Wasn't a fan of 13 or 15. Sorry. And definitely not 16. <laughs> <laughs> 16 was weird. Yeah, yeah. Too much profanity. I didn't like it. Like, we read an article yesterday about how, like, cussing is becoming more acceptable and how like the F word isn't even on the top 10 for most people. But I'm, but to me, I guess I'm just old school or old or whatever. I didn't like that my Final Fantasy game had the F word in every single sentence. Yeah. It's like y'all need to calm down. You're being way too aggressive. <laughs> well, every once in a while is fine. But the character is just saying it like over and over again. Yeah, it was ridiculous. I think 16 had really crappy writing. Um, this one hasn't said it once. I know. Well, Sid may cuss. <laughs> he hasn't said the F word, though. No. There's always a possibility for that. That's true, but I just think they should tone it down. I expected a whole lot more from 16, knowing that the 14 people made it. Mm hmm I was really, really disappointed. The only thing I liked about it was the cool summon fights cutscenes or whatever and that's about it. The graphics were not even what you expect from a Final Fantasy game either. All the all the face models look like generic MMO faces. Yeah. Let you, can, me out. you can tell the uh, MMO team's not very good at making faces. <laughs> Yeah. 
I remember when I, I first watched the trailer and I was like, really? Is this like a beta? <laughs> Are these placeholders? Are these character face models? That can't be, that can't be the final part. It was. Like, okay. I guess people like me ex have a certain expectation when they play a Square Enix game. Yes. Even the ones I hated the most, like 13, they looked great. Mm -hmm. 16 was weird. Really, really weird game. Like I had an identity crisis. We do this fast. <laughs> Got things to do. Time to burn. Brace yourself. Sorry. Enemies HP is getting more spongy. Mm -hmm. Is that it? They're probably expecting you to like stagger them and stuff. Pressure them. Probably. Hmm. I kind of got turned around. Keep going in there. You this, need... this way? No, you, that's where you came from. Are you sure? Yeah. It's the other way. Or maybe this wall. Well, yeah, fully explore the other area. Yeah, you need to fully explore up there. Okay. Bun buns. <laughs> what are y'all doing up here? He's like right there. Hey, right there. Ooh, five Moogle medals. Wrong way. Are you sure? Uh -huh. I thought that's the way the nope. owl or the thingy went. No, he's, back. he's going back here. This way? You keep trying to go on the entrance. You really like that entrance, but that's not the way to go. It went up there. I don't know if you can get up there right here. I have to go deeper in. See, this is a dead end. Yeah, explore up. Just jump up and, and look around. There you was kind of hard to find. And these are getting harder and harder. They used to be just circle, 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 circle. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Where 
square, triangle, triangle, circle, X, circle, X. Oh gosh. That's weird. Okay. Move way slow. There you go. Okay, good. Good job. <laughs> we need like half the jungle still and the final place. No, it was on before that. Mm -hmm. that We're locked out by the story. Yes. You have to go back after chapter 12. But, um... And then the Cosmo Canyon, we still need quite oh, yeah. a bit of stuff, You're too. Right. We're really behind. Mm -hmm. the new Zelda game, Tears of the Kingdom, and I got all the dungeons done, and that took me like 100 hours. Oh, yeah. It took yeah. me forever. Great game, though. It's not. It's going to be on the ground. Oh, you think so? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, maybe it's inside this thing. Yeah. Just fall down. They're nothing. Just frogs. <laughs> That's that. I died fast. Sure did. Can you use Circle Jet anywhere? Yes, but you go up higher if you're in water. Mm. I wish I can use the Choco Jet and the Jungle. Me too. One more. I think Red's stuck back there. <laughs> Poor Red. Up in the hill. Well, that is so handy being able to do that now. I was so annoyed that you couldn't just climb mountains. Oh, I know. To. Me too. There, you're done. Yay! <laughs> You're knocking them out pretty fast. Mm -hmm. This chocobo is awesome. Yeah, it is. It's a cool area. It is a really cool area. I was so scared after the jungle that the, the last two areas were going to be like awful. This jungle really kind of scared me. There's one giant maze. Yeah. You got kind of claustrophobic. It was 
was pretty bad. <laughs> we'll do that one last. And I'll take a Sanax before I play, so I'm not so cranky. There you go. Ooh. Won't last long. <laughs> Second wind. It's a zoo. You have, you have the high ground right there, don't you? Yeah, but I'm trying to get away from the high ground. <laughs> So long. I think you have about a 20% accuracy rate when it comes to the braver. <laughs> it's, almost, it's almost incredible how much you miss it. I really do. Going in. Yeah. There you go. You can't miss it when they're staggered, That's but right. knowing you. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just kidding. Whoa. Oh, I thought that was like AP. Or uh, whatever it's called now, SP. Like a level up. I was like, dang. You have a lot of points, but that's just MP. Yeah. heck is this owl going? <laughs> no, no. I focus more on your map. You kind of know where they are. He's over there. I see. Oh, don't worry about the digging. Okay. Man, my stomach is still turning. Ah. <sighs> I hate being sick. Oh, I know. I hate when you're sick. I'm not sure it's worse, like having a fever and like a head cold, because I hate that just as much. But having a stomach issue, that's... Oof. To me, that's the worst. I feel like I can't eat anything. What does choco grass do? I don't know. You found it. King Zoo. Nice. Cool. Seeing as this talent's terror has been causing trouble for the black robes, I suggest that you clip its wings. Avian Tyrant. Is that one of the ones that picked up the robe at the first of the game? Oh, maybe. I might have to call it soon. I'm not feeling very good. Let's make this our last one. Okay. I'm really dizzy and nauseous. Okay. Oop. It's probably from a lack of food, but like all I had was like grapes and one piece of toast and a banana last night and some crackers. Ooh, salty crackers were not good coming back up again. Oof. Lovely. You ever had that before? Oh, it's so salty and gross. Yeah, it's bad. Ugh. I would recommend salty things when you're sick. No. There's my way out. There we go. Yeah, anything too sugary too, like Gatorade. Ugh, that was tasting gross after a while. Mm -hmm. The sugar just really... Ugh. Yeah. I'm just drinking like straight up water. 
The warm tea wasn't very good either. I would highly recommend avoiding warm drinks when you have this virus. Ow. Some people online recommended like chamomile tea or peppermint tea to just help with nausea. Just to make sure it's hot. You went too far away. Uh, sure did. Yeah. I was doing ice chips too, but I think that they were too cold and I started feeling, I ate so many that I started feeling like I had like, you know, freezer burn in my mouth. Oh. So I didn't want to do that either. Just have to avoid dehydration. Drink whatever you can. I think that was just treasure. Maybe this one. It's like he has a ceiling. Nope. He can't go any past a certain point. It's too high up. Whoa, camera. <laughs> well, the camera's stupid sometimes. Sometimes it is, yeah. Well, how the hell do you get in there? You can't go up there right there, honey. But there's, a, there's a limit. I know. An elevation. You already tried that. I'll look for a hole inside the wall or something. Maybe right here. Coming from the water side. Too far away. Yeah, that doesn't. Step on that rock and jump over there. Okay. Look that way. <laughs> mm -mm. Mm. Too far away. That's just stupid. It's like your bird's getting stupid when it comes to Choco Jet all of a sudden. Yes. The mountain has built in. Like limits. FU parameters. <laughs> oh, here. Take me to your bench. That's handy. What's on his butt this time? It looks like an eggplant. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just call it here. I'm sorry. I'm too sick. That's okay. Go ahead and save it. And, uh, thanks for watching. Hopefully tomorrow I'll feel better. If not, I'll see you later. <laughs> <laughs>